One of the most talented young artists in America is a fellow named Brent Binger. Now he's nationally known, and you'll know him too if you've seen Sports Illustrated, with some marvelous drawings of, among others, Nolan Ryan. Well, Brent Binger did a beautiful oil painting of Oral Hershiser. There's somewhat of a story behind it, and so this section of the show is labeled Portrait of a Pitcher. Located on the banks of the Potomac River in Washington, D.C., the John F. Kennedy Center for the Performing Arts is the cultural center of the United States. The center is much more than a memorial to the 35th President of the United States. It is the home of very special arts. Since its founding in 1974, Very Special Arts has coordinated arts programs for people with disabilities. Very Special Arts recently honored Dodger pitcher Oral Hershiser with a portrait by noted sports artist Brent Binger. I think Brent did an outstanding job just capturing uh, my personality at a clinic. Uh, I really believe that uh, when I go to clinics that, you know, the number one thing in those kids' heart is to find out what's on this big leaguer's mind, and it's so nice to be up close and, and personal, person, you know, to somebody. So. Uh, it was exciting to see this captured in oil this way because so many different times I've been captured in photographs like pitching on the mound or sitting in the dugout, but at a clinic that was just, just a great setting, I thought. The man charged with capturing oil on canvas is Brent Binger, an artist whose work has graced the cover of Sports Illustrated. When I was approached with the idea about, uh, with very special arts to do the painting, we wanted to have uh, a story having to do with oral and children. And uh, I really thought oral was the right art, uh, uh, player for that because he does uh, deal with the public so much. He does so many things off the field besides just play baseball. Um, so what we wanted to do is have a painting where he was interacting with the community. The painting depicts Oral at a clinic surrounded by young people, two of whom look rather familiar. When we went over the, uh, the painting and how many different people were going to be in the background and what they would be doing and Brent came all with the ideas, I said that one of the things that I would really like is to have uh, my two sons captured in there. And Quentin, uh, my eight-year-old, is in here staring up at Daddy. And Jordan, my four-year-old, is in here staring up at Daddy. And I just thought that was just fantastic so that when it's hanging in our house and that just kind of more of a conversation piece for our family and something that captured that moment in time that when they travel around and saw their dad at clinics and doing different things in the big leagues, they'll be able to, to remember back to that time. I think he's pretty unique today in the world of baseball and that Oral takes his responsibility as a baseball player like I said, not just on the field and doing well on the field, but also carrying that off the field and uh, representing the Dodgers and Major League Baseball in a positive light off the field. Um, I like to hook up with the uh, players that, that have that kind of a reputation, um, and I think Oral epitomizes that. The painting, which will be part of an exhibit in the United States Capitol, also came with a plaque. The presentation by J.W. McIntosh on behalf of Very Special Arts. As a token of our appreciation, we want to present to you this plaque and thank you for your interest and your support. Oh, thank you so much, Jay. This is my pleasure to accept this and uh, what very little that I do in, in posing for the painting and working with Brent and uh, maybe a few appearances for the Very Special Arts, I just think that uh, the cause is fantastic and anybody that we can help with disabilities or people that aren't quite as fortunate as others, we're gonna do all the work that we can. Thank you.